Hey guys, it's John and welcome to my playthrough of Mouthwashing. This is a brand new horror game, just came out uh, pretty recently, I think in the past few days or maybe a few weeks. It was developed by Wrong Organ, who made one other game in 2022, I think it was a free game called How Fish Is Made. I never played it, but uh, this is their latest and we're gonna check it out here, right now, for my horror game month. This is wonderful grandiose music here. We're gonna turn off head bob, no offense. And we're gonna turn on show subtitles. And that's that. All right, let's go ahead and start a new game. I don't know what it's about, by the way. I think there's mouthwash involved. Just a guess. I would say it's safe to assume this is going to be a weird game. Pony Express Long Haul Space Freighter Tolpar, crew of five, planned shipment duration 382 days, elapsed transit time 147 days, so about halfway through. I hope this hurts. Okay. That's a little unnecessary, I think. Why would you hope it hurts? I got an achievement. Called Start Mouthwashing. I just want to let it be known that uh, I've actually used mouthwash a lot throughout my life. This is not my first time. Uh, zero days before the crash? Okay. An orbital body has been detected 21 AU ahead of the vessel. Please make a manual correction 1.4 degrees leftwards to avoid impact with unknown mass. Uh. Hmm. And you're just assuming that I know what I'm doing. Steer right. Okay. I'm doing that. Extreme warning. Direct collision course with orbital body 1.9 AU away. Engaging autopilot to recorrect vessel. Advise crew to take up emergency positions. 4,000 credits docked from crew pay package for failure of navigational staff. I just want to see what would happen. What does this do? It's locked. Hmm. Do we have, like, key or something? I don't... I don't know. Okay, let's move. Oh! Oh! Sorry, it said zero days before crash. I thought we were supposed to crash. We're not supposed to crash. I can't let anyone in. <gasps> Cause we're crashing the we're crashing the ship. A length of nylon rope. Oh, look at the key over here. Take emergency key. Hmm. I guess we'll use that key, huh? What is this? Captain access only. Code scanner required. Okay. I got an achievement. Find Anya's employee card. Hmm. Are we supposed to be familiar with Anya? Are we Anya? <laughs> They're gonna be Anya soon. Anya ass! Uh, once you crash this ship... Okay, um, let's sit back in the... I guess, you know, we'll just... Use the emergency key... Listen, it said zero days before crash. We're just crash imminent. Uh, so why have we done this? Would you say? Is there is there a reason? Paul says, "Don't be daft." <laughs> Don't be daft. Oh boy. Are you daft? Let's go in here. Wow, they really like this horse guy. Rise and shine! Lend a hand! Okay, well, thank you, British horse, but. Wow, they really like this horse. I guess it's Polly, right? Is that how it's pronounced? Polly? Rise and shine, lend a hand, don't be daft! It's that simple! Okay, we're in some kind. Giddy up, 
galaxy. Hmm. It's like we're we're in a PT loop. Oh no, it's not a PT clone, is it? No, it's just this one part, right? It's just this one part, right? We're not gonna have psychological horror suddenly, are we? This whole ship isn't like a metaphor for us wrestling with our guilt, is it? Are we feeling trapped in the ship just like we're feeling trapped by our own decisions in life? Oh, I turn around. Turn around. Turn around, is there, is there something I can do? Oh. Oh. Oh no, it's Polly! It's a mascot horror game! I was wrong! If it's not a PT clone, it's a mascot horror game. I should have known. Well. Oh, now it opens. I see. We gotta get out of here. The crash is imminent. Oh. Oh my god. Polly's gonna clap my cheeks. Now I gotta be. I gotta be a typical mascot horror YouTuber. Polly's gonna clap my ass cheeks together. Polly's coming after my cheeks. Maybe we could run. That might make things quicker. Hey, red. We all know what the color red means. It means that it's scary time. Horror is approaching. Horror is here. Horror is imminent. No. Two months after the crash. Hey, there's Anya. She's on your right. Jimmy, anyone else would do the same thing. We ain't touching the damn cargo. The hold is locked down for a reason. The only thing worse than dying slowly is not getting paid. But it could be something useful, I think. Could be what? Hopes, dreams, and... Marzipan? That's not how you pronounce that, is it? Because that's how it's spelled, so that means it's not how it's pronounced. Ha! You don't have to. If it helps us survive, it's worth it. Man, Pony Express bosses really aren't chill at all, huh? Come on, a quick look won't hurt. How exactly is this group therapy committee planning on getting us out of here? Or get getting in there, rather. <laughs> different goal. Oh, right here, boss. You're looking at the meanest swing of the regional junior baseball team. Straight up, nearly corked a kid once. I can take the utility axe and you were goddamn born fully corked. That's enough, Swansea. There has to be a in case of emergency way inside. If I remember correctly from the safety protocols, the door should have an alternate access code, but it can only be uncovered using a code scanner device. And only the captain has access to the scanner. Of course, go ahead and ask him all about it then. Maybe he'll sing you the blues too. We don't need him if we find the scanner, get the code and open the hold. For better or worse, I'm captain now. I'll figure it out. Right on. We gotta acquire the code scanner, y'all. Where'd everybody go? Where'd my Pony Express friends go? Hmm. Papa Polly's delights. Would you like some water or maybe some gelatin? <laughs> A meat pie? Oh, this is so British. <laughs> A meat. They love their meat pies over there. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, if you're a British fan of mine, you knew you weren't getting out of here unscathed. Come on. I can't let the meat pie thing go without a comment. Anytime I bring up, like, cherry pie or apple pie, the Brits are always like, fruit in a pie? They actually sell plushies of this guy for kids. Yeah. 
I can't wait to see official mouthwashing merch featuring Polly the horse. It'll be ironic, I'm sure. Good thing we had extra medical mattresses. The floor isn't that bad. There's an original Game Boy I spy there. The thick kind. The battery drainer. That's what we used to call it. Four AA batteries. Here's a mug, by the way. Now, a lot of any horror developers like to have just plain white mugs. But, uh, not this one. They actually have something on it. It almost looks like Howard the Duck. I can't really see what's on it, though. Um, okay, let's talk to... Okay, so you guys are just kind of like hanging out here, huh? Swansea's bed. Fortunately, we can still hear him snore. Swansea's not Irish, is he? Because if he is, then that's not how you pronounce that word. That's what I've learned about Irish names. We'd be dead without this thing. Never thought I'd be thankful for Pony Express Grub. This machine was empty even before the crash. Swansea saw to that. Y'all are playing board games? Oh, this looks like Sorry. Hi, Daisuke. Looks like it'll be soup again for dinner. You want rock, paper, scissors for the chicken noodle? How much food do we have left? I'd say like four months-ish. Hmm, less than the remaining air supply, but we can make it last, in theory. We'll be starting to poke new holes in our belts pretty soon to pull that off. Man, my mom will straight up stuff me when I get back. I'll look like Swansea. We'll have a rad story to tell though. They might even write articles about us. We could be on TV. Uh, it'll impress the ladies too. Hell yeah. The real problem is us running out of toilet paper. Fatal stuff, man. We should leave that part out for the press. Yeah, you know, should, should definitely not tell them the part about the toilet paper. Clown mania. What it means to be, learn what it means to be clown meat. <laughs> Greatest clown ever? Exclusive review. Interesting. Right next to that, we got books on the obverse and astronomy. I know, you guys. You're impressed that I can see see that well. Well, I got 2020 vision. Oh, it says Pony Express. It's not Howard the Duck. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> hmm. Okay. So, uh, we got the spray foam here. We doing okay? Anya. And you. Hmm. Is everything okay? He doesn't want to keep still anymore. What about the painkillers? He... It just hurts him so much. I can't stand the noise. You did make it through nursing school, right? Pony Express sure does know how to cut corners, if nothing else. Um, I was thinking, we never went back into the cockpit after we dragged him out. It's almost entirely foamed up. Kind of a miracle Curly didn't end up fossilizing. But it could still be unstable. I just think, well, it's the only place the code scanner could still be. Otherwise, we're shit out of luck. I'll take a look. I know you'll figure it out, Jimmy. You're so capable. Oh, also, well, um... I was hoping you could help me with Captain... Curly. Right, sorry. With Curly's medication. People have to be worth their titles. Don't you think? Nurse Anya? Y yeah. Forget I asked. I'll take care of it. Wow, okay, so there's some... There's some aggression happening here. Hmm. These are all we have left. Take the painkillers. Okay, you can only take one. I was just checking to see if we could take one. So, so we were playing as Captain Curly in the intro when we... When we, uh... Set ourselves on a, a crash course. On purpose. 
Interesting. And I'm guessing Anya's card was in the locker because... Um, but now I'm the captain, Jimmy, and it's been two months. We're running out of food and air. We need to get the code scanner. Just in case, you know, anybody need any help catching up. Sometimes it helps me to say it out loud. This vent has been busted forever, at least according to Swansea. Probably beyond wrecked now. Why is it called mouthwashing? Hmm. The title was uh, one item of interest for me. That goes way down. I'm gonna check over here because there's another way to get out. Can you, can you get in there? Oh, the locker is blocked off by foam. I need something to break it. Okay. Well, yeah, let's try over here. Cockpit, utility cargo. Right, cockpit is okay. And, uh, well, what's over here? We actually don't know. Interesting. Okay, well, this goes down as well. You know, if my mental map is accurate, we might actually be meeting up. Oh, there's Swansea. Look at him. Huh. Very serious, man. Ain't you supposed to be figuring out our greatest cargo robbery? Why are you standing out here? None of your goddamn business. Everything is my business now because of Curly. I don't want to keep having this conversation. Right, right. Capitano. I'm working. Blue collar fools can't afford to stop working, even when the machine does. <laughs> Go figure. And before you start, I'm taking a break. Don't you worry, I ain't going over my break time allowance. Ha! Working on what? How does it look in there? It's a solid wall of foam. I'm trying to see if I can break it down enough to get something useful out. Ain't in my tools. But if I breach that foam and break the air seal, it's lights out for all of us. I ain't letting anyone else mess around in there. Even Daisuke? He's your intern. He's supposed to be helpful. You think I'm letting that knucklehead in here after the crash roughed it up? Our so-called nurse nearly skewered her leg when the vent hatch was open during maintenance. And that was before the crash. I warned her, but it's in one ear, out the other. Then there's that teeny bopper thinking only with his downstairs long notes. Just like my useless kids back home. So no, ain't letting anyone mess around in here. Alright, Swansea. Keep me updated. Is this one of those games where you have to like exhaust the dialogue? Oh, I wasn't sure if this opened or not. Cockpit. Let's go over here. Well, we need a code. Entry strictly prohibited. Code scanner. Uh, okay. And then this goes back up. Okay. I'm assuming that this is... Yes, it is. Okay. So now this is where we were supposed to go down earlier by where Anya and Curly are. Captain Curly. Okay, so. We're all caught up. Let's go this way to the cockpit. We talked to all the different characters. The eclectic crew. This is where we were earlier. Look at all the foam. Code scanner. I actually don't know. This should be useful if the main power shuts down. Right. Wait, so let me let me get this straight. You guys it's been two months and you guys haven't looked for the code scanner in here. Anya's tag is gone.
I don't remember seeing any kind of code scanner. Where's that? It's like a blue. Oh, oh wait, wait, is it right here? Oh no, that's like a flashlight. Oh, that's a code scanner. What? You guys have been fiddling around here for two months. Oh, where's the code? I don't know where the code scanner is. There's like two places to go in here. The ship is tiny. He's gone. Swansea hasn't let anyone in utility since the crash. It says it's filled with foam. Oh, I guess we should respect his privacy. Wait, if it's locked, then why was he standing in front of it? Maybe he said that and I just wasn't listening. I was too busy trying to give him a tough voice. Oh, now, oh, now what are you protecting? Who's that? Who's that annoying little Kokiri guy at the beginning of Ocarina of Time? That's just like, no, you can't go in here unless you have a shield and a sword. Milo or something? I can't remember his name. Our nurse should be here. Even she could make the situation worse with her presence. Okay. I'll go get her. Jeez. Yeah, that's what that guy's like, though. You'd think as the number one Ocarina of Time fan in the world, I would know the name of that character. <laughs> but I don't. Because I'm not the number one fan. Sorry to disappoint. Hi. Are you going to feed Curly's meds? He really suffers without them. Yeah, yeah. His bandages are also looking wet. I know. We're out of fresh ones. I'll give it to him. Okay, here you go. Bye. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oxycodone. Okay. The good stuff. His mouth is closed. Okay. We have to have them open. Hold still, yeah? I don't like this any more than you do. You know what they say. Pain is how we know we're still living. Jimmy sucks. Jimmy sucks. I can't bear to listen. Excuse me. Sorry. Jeez. Okay. All right. Um. Well, I guess it doesn't get a signal anymore. Fortunately, Anya and Swansea's playlist survived the crash. Up or down? The illusion of choice. Oh boy, these illusion of choice people. Oh my God. Do you really have a choice? It's a test an illusion. Oh my god, it gets into this like free will versus predestination. I can't stand it. I can't stand it. Shut up. No no one has the heart to tell you, but you're annoying. Hi Anya. We don't have a whole lot of painkillers left. But you still wanna keep Why do you think he did it? Does it matter? What answer would make you feel any better? I have to believe that our worst moments don't make us monsters, Jim. I have to. Even in his case. He tried to take us all down with him, Anya. The way I see it, there's two reasons to keep him alive at this point. Guess the important bit is that we all agreed to it. For one reason or another. I'm still feeling nauseous. I need a minute. Okay, okay, well. Where's Daisuke? Oh my gosh, look how dystopian this is. Look at the sunset. It's here 24 seven. <laughs> wow. All the characters are disappearing. Okay. But yeah, miss me with that. <laughs> the illusion of choice.
Anyone know my conclusion? We have a choice. There. Done. Donezo with that conversation. What do you guys think we've been shipping? If it's spare parts, maybe me and Swansea can repair the ship and we can get out of here. Right, Swansea? Quit yapping. I just realized they sound kind of... <laughs> he sounds like a chill. They have the same voice. He sounds kind of chill and he sounds really dramatic. Are we doing the right thing? Let it be medicine, food, or water. Yeah. Let's... Wait, wait, what am I doing? Hmm. Wait, how do I get... How do I get in here? Use to reveal access codes. Oh. 4517. Okay. Probably want to turn it off. Seven days before the crash. What's in all those boxes? Is it mouthwash? <laughs> hmm. Are you listening? Ah, uh, okay. I gotta think of a voice for Curly. Yeah, yeah, damn. I'm so sorry. Couldn't sleep again. But I passed the psych eval? Well, you gave the same answers as last time. I do wish you'd open up a little more, Captain. These evaluations aren't just about you. As long as I'm fit to fly in your eyes, Anya. Oh, stop it. Guess that means I only have one more eval left to do. Jimmy? He acts as if I do these things for fun. Then I have to make a report with things like, I have found myself Sexually excited at the sight of cartoon horses. <laughs> well, I could take it off your hands. Really? I've known him a long time. He won't try any bullshit with me. I suppose you are the captain. I am the captain. Thank you. What a relief. Oh, before I forget, Swansea asked me to give you this. <laughs> they can't expect me to perform miracles. <laughs> Not sure what it means, but sounds like fun. Good luck, Captain. Talk to Jimmy and Swansea. So now we're playing as Curly. Daisuke described his experience as intern so far as awesome, super cool, and like totally awesome. Like, really awesome. Should I be worried? Um, yeah, there's really no reason to be worried about him. I've been bringing the same playlist along for years. When it's right, it's right. Hmm. Look at all these pills. Calendar. Hmm, we are here for you. Swansea and Daisuke have been fixing this broken vent for days. Best to stay away. Okay, look, a foamless environment. Very cool. Nope. Oh. Ah, I see. Oh, the same sorry board is out. I mean, okay, there's five of us and there's four players. So who wasn't playing? You got Daisuke, Swansea, Anya, Curly and Jimmy. So, who wasn't playing? Not a five-player game. More importantly, who's what color? None of them have scored yet. Who's in the best position? Not purple. They got three guys at home. Um, it looks like... I'm trying to figure out which way the board goes. Oh, okay, so it goes uh, clockwise. Well, you know, I'd say blue is in a really good position. 
They got three guys out, one of them's about to go in, and another one's right behind them. Followed by... Green? Yeah. Blue's in the lead, green's in second, yellow's in third, and purple is in a distant fourth. They basically just started. Oh! Anya and Daisuke get really intense about game night. Okay, so that answers our question. Swansea doesn't play, you, you gotta think. He's always insanely lucky, too. Drives are crazy. Okay, so Daisuke is blue then, because, yeah. And I would guess Anya's green. Yeah. That's what I think. The last roll was an 11. Okay, you guys are probably screaming at your screens right now. Who cares? I do. And this is oh, all about does. me. And he's Pony Boy. Hmm. Okay, I wonder if I'll have to use this at some point to like make stuff. This mug is still here, by the way. Huh. Okay. Cockpit. You still oh, what's in here? The door to my quarters. I'm still on the clock though. Okay, well, let's go look around then, I guess. Is this Jimmy? Oh my god. And Pony Express said they don't provide onboard entertainment. Feels like there's always something broken in that room. Topar's starting to show her age. Past inspection, right? Shouldn't be an issue. Hmm. Plus they added Daisuke last minute. Didn't account that there'd be five of us now. I really should have made a bigger stink about that. Hmm. Okay, so this is the room that Swansea doesn't let anyone in. There's a fire axe here. That might be important. Oh my god. Well, I can see the issue. The kid was brought on just to make me suffer! Intern my ass. I was just trying to fix the vent. How did that trigger the emergency foam? Because you're talented in all the wrong ways. I would have dealt with this, but only you can unlock the axe case. Every goddamn thing has to go through you. I'll handle it. Oh, wait. Uh, I'll handle it. Hang in there, Daisuke. Okay. Oh. Nope, from Swansea. Okay. Oh, right. 2609. Oh boy, okay. I think I got it! <laughs> Hang in there, yeah? Okay. Oh, sorry. Ouch! Oof. Strong stuff, huh? Get it through your goddamn skull. That vent is strictly off limits! Fully fucking collapsed inside. You looking to get impaled, electrocuted, and cooked? Yeah, but like... You can't fit in there to fix it, right? So I can totally handle it. Captain? Give me the axe. Swansea. This could have damaged the pods. You can't let something like this happen again. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Loud and clear. Keep the axe until you've cleaned this all up, yeah? Well, what are you gonna do now? It's okay to be big, boss. My grants was super huge. 
And he lived until, like, 60. What are you standing around for? Clean this mess up. Let's look around. Ooh, do not touch. Look at all the blueprints and stuff. Okay. Seems like Swansea is teaching Daisuke the basics. He's got a long way to go. Emergency cryogenic pods. They have about 20 years of backup power. So this is the room that's supposedly covered in foam. Is that right? The cryogenic pods. Interesting. I take it Anya diagnosed you with being sane then. Just off center, but it's what keeps me on my toes. I said I'd do yours. I want to hear all about those cartoon horses. Is that something you were born with or a recent develop? All right, all right, shut up. Let's go to the cockpit. Oh, okay. <laughs> it still had me zoomed in. Okay, uh, cockpit is... Not down here. Oh, it's right here. Isn't it? Oh, you know, this is all foamed up. This is the cockpit. Wait. Hmm. We're getting Silent Hill 2 right now. And I don't mean smothered to death. Silent Hill 2 remake in just a couple days, guys. <gasps> Who's excited? Me. I'm excited. What the hell is going on? Interesting, the longer I look at it, the brighter it becomes. It's your fault, your fault, your fault. You're the one who did this, did this, did this. Why did you do it? Do it, do it, do it, do it. Moving forward, just so you know. Hmm. Anya's ID card is not in here. I don't know, I'm all hung up on that. I need to leave this here just in case. Okay. can't just make something up for this. It's not like these evals ever go anywhere when we get back. We'll power through it. Have you been able to complete your mandated tasks as co-pilot efficiently and to your fullest capacity? Ugh. 
Let's see. I'll just put good for that one. And that's all of them. Done and done. How are things otherwise? Off the record. I like it. We're in control here. Didn't think you'd ever take to being a fre uh, freighter pilot as well as you have. Well, with how you struggled back on Earth. Sure, all I ever hear is how great of a leader you are. Honestly, it's kind of annoying. So, what is it? Hmm? How come it always seems like you're standing on the edge of a bridge with your feet in cement? Lately, I've just been thinking. Is this enough? Should I just stay here because I've been successful at it? A good long haul freighter captain. And that's bad. That's what I'm saying. It's not. But it's terrifying. I think, am I figured out? Is this all I'll ever be? Or do I take the risk and try something new? Even if I'm bad at it. Hmm. I guess I get it. You reached the highest rung on this ladder. So now you're thinking you might be on the wrong ladder altogether. Still a long way down from the top, no matter how you look at it. While I'm still climbing and climbing. Something like that. But hey, 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 you know I believe in you. Here, on Earth. Doesn't matter. Here or on Earth, it doesn't matter. Ha! You should write that on the psych eval. Message incoming. Oh no. The big guys themselves. Guess that's my cue. I'll see you later. Message incoming. Is there... Where's the message? Oh, it's over here? News from corporate. Or if this has anything to do with it. After all the... Oh. Dragon breath mouthwash. It's, this is, oh my God, that's all that's in the cargo. A business operating at a steady profit can give its workers security and employee benefits. Operating at a profit, a business can provide the employee with comfortable, colorful working conditions. wages and steady employment first aid and health protection here in fact is the answer to a dream as old as man himself a giant of limitless power at man's command. I guess these are like, uh, what is it? Public domain clips. Who's this? Oh no, is it an ad for mouthwash? A revolutionary new dental hygiene product. Brand new formula designed to kill bacteria and kill germs without leaving a bad taste. Dragon Breath X Mouthwash. All day fire fresh. <laughs> Consult with your local dentist, dental hygiene specialist before, during, and after use of Dragon Breath X Mouthwash. 
Okay, so we're back. It's... This is... Mouthwash? Unfucking believable There's gotta be an ocean of the stuff in here. This room looks freaking endless. This is what they'd have five people hauling for over a year. All of this for mouthwash? The sugar content probably offsets any potential as a disinfectant. Disinfectant? What are you? Let me see that. 14% ethanol. Ha! <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I, I suppose uh, we'll smell good at least. That's right, kiddo. You can bet your ass on that. What are you doing? Stop that. <laughs> oh, shut up. I'm just an old codger taking care of its dental hygiene. You hear that? That's the sound of 15 years of sobriety popping like a cyst. Glorious, magnificent, red hot cyst. Good riddance and cheers to Captain Curly. Here, here. Guess anyone could get seriously blasted off of this stuff. Yeah, and kill you in the process. This can't be real. I... There's no way. Now we can go out in style. Daisuke, come here. Anyone ever teach you how to drink like a man? That is crazy. Break the news. Okay. Break the news. About what? Surprise. Surprise. Look at your face. <laughs> gotcha. Cheers. Uh, wow. What's the, uh, occasion? We only get one communal birthday party per trip, right? This feels- have you guys- have any of you seen Severance? First of all, if you haven't seen Severance on Apple TV+, Plus, I just gotta thoroughly recommend it, okay? What the- the season one finale is like one of the best episodes of television I've ever seen. Uh, and that's all I'll say about it. I'm not gonna try to oversell it. But also, if you're kind of liking the vibes of this so far, it, it's reminded me a little bit. So we can have it whenever. Only one person can really be surprised birthdayed per trip. We did Swansea last haul, remember? No way! I can't believe I missed that! You were next on the list, so congratulations. I hate to say it though, your duties have to extend to even your own birthday party. You're the only one with clearance to make the cake. The recipe is there by the machine. Hop to it, Captain. We gotta bake a cake. If I knew you were coming, I'd bake the cake. Bake the cake. I can't move. Bake the cake. Oh, I gotta bounce out of it. Happy birthday. Everyone's so happy. You gonna use the Pony Express provided cake recipe? At least make it correctly. You should find the ingredients and recipe in the kitchen. Swansea really likes that cake. Don't tell anyone. Hmm. Hmm. I think you need to use the code scanner? They're really getting a lot of mileage out of that thing, huh? You know how it is. Pony Express being either cheap or lazy. Usually both, no? Polly says, another day in paradise. Yay! I'm amazed that this thing is still intact two months after the crash. Because I would have manhandled this thing by then. It would be in pieces. Sorry for jumping you. This whole thing is corny. 
but you know, it's kind of a tradition now. I dare say I almost look forward to it. Hmm? Nothing. Yeah, no, I agree. After all these years, just like that. Am I fired? That must be the, that must be the, uh, that's what Jimmy meant by he's gonna take us all down with him. Could you sneak an extra packet of sweetener in there? Just kidding. <laughs> Maybe? Nah, nah, totally kidding. Unless. Okay, um, what am I doing? Take water packet. Okay, so wait, there's... I'm making cake for a bit. Look at this gigantic knife. That's like a cleaver. That's the type of knife that you would get to murder someone if you're like ghost face. What type you would make for cooking? Okay, I gotta get like ingredients, right? What? Oh, oh. Water, gelatin, sweetener, and tonic. Oh my god, I just get I guessed these. I guessed these. Oh, four, two, one, three. Oh, restricted. I oh my gosh. Oh wait, so I got sweetener, water packet. Oh, I already got gelatin. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. One, three, four. Two, three, four, one. I already got sweetener. Whoopsie. Sorry. Um, yeah, I didn't even... Okay, I get it. I get it. Sweetener to be used only for crew morale boosting activities. Celebration prohibited in case of mediocre performance. One, three, two, four. Okay, wait, what's the cake recipe? Okay, so blue, orange, and pink. Okay. Okay, okay, here we go. Preparing the cake with the culinary auto mixer. Mix water and gelatin, mix cake base and sweetener. Cake base, how do I get cake base? Um. Oh, water and gelatin makes cake base. So water and gelatin together. Oh, water and gelatin. Now. Okay, so now we got the cake base. Okay, so. And then we use, is it the sweetener? Yes, yeah, so we don't use the tonic. The tonic is for drinks. It's better than nothing. Okay. Ah, oh, we got the cake, y'all. It doesn't even do the full thing, it just does that part. Ah, oh, everybody's ready to eat. You gotta make a speech! Can't argue with that. Speech, speech, speech! Go on. I... Hey. What's wrong? 
That's all it said on the report from management. We will receive the paycheck for this delivery. I don't know any more than that. Pony Express finally kicking the bucket, huh? What a joke. And we're the punchline. I don't have any savings. They can't just do this, right? Pony Express is one of the last man crew freighter companies. The writing's been on the wall for a long time. When did they tell you? Earlier this week, I was instructed to wait until we're closer to the hall destination. But I can't keep something like this from you all. So I guess you got what you wanted without the guilt. Jim, if, if I had known, I can go back to my, how'd you put it, struggle of a life. Anya never got into medical school because she's, well, let's be real. And how many employment years Swansea got left in him. Daisuke will be fine. Mommy and Daddy have him covered, so there's that at least. But you, headed for the bigger and better, right? I'm just, I, I'm just working on my life being a place I don't have to fucking escape. That's what I was trying to tell you, nothing more. We're the ones you're trying to escape. Leave the dirt behind now that your boots are clean. That's not what I meant. It is what you meant. You just couldn't frame it to yourself in a way that kept you as the hero. Abandon the crew, but remain the model captain. Unbelievable. What, what am I supposed to do? Let's have some fucking cake, huh? Props to the Twilight crews of the Tulpar. Props to our captain and his new prospects. What am I doing? Oh, okay. I'm moving the mouse back and forth right now. It's interesting. He's still asleep. Check on Curly. Oh boy. Well, that sounds like fun. Um, I'm gonna take a moment to take uh, just a little break. I actually need to use the men's room. And uh, yeah, so <laughs> I don't know why I'm being weird about it. Okay, I'll see you in a second. Hi, I'm back. I took care of business. Won't go into more detail than that. All right, let's go ahead and get back to mouthwashing. <laughs> Daisuke's a sweep. That's Daisuke's uh, Game Boy. That makes sense. All right, so what are we doing? What is the sound? Do you hear that in the background? What is that sound? What is going on? Do I want to know? Kind of sounds like... Oh my gosh. Kind of sounds like some exciting things are happening. Some adult entertainment, perhaps? Okay, I think it's actually... Is it coming from... Where I think it's coming from? Hmm. I don't know if he's been given his medicine yet. Oh, oh. Just a handful left. Once these are out, we'll have nothing to keep him quiet. Can't use this here. 
Oh, we gotta find Anya and find out if he's been giving his me- Okay, oh my gosh. I would say from the way he's acting, probably not. He probably hasn't been given it yet. Damn, I thought some, I thought some sexy time was happening. <laughs> I don't know what was going on. I didn't know Curly was involved or what. Okay, let's go find Anya then. Is she in the cockpit? Hello, you two. No, I understand completely. If that's how it has to be... Hmm? Oh, it's you. Jimmy! Not able to sleep either? Oh. Jimmy! Not able to sleep either? <laughs> it's nighttime. Why are you talking this late? Anya, are you crying? No, don't worry. <laughs> I'm okay. We all need to keep it together. Oh, I'm keeping it together. Don't you worry, Capitan. He's making noises again. Did you give him his meds before, Anya? Uh, no, must have slipped my mind. I'm sorry, I'll... I'll do it. No, really, I'm perfectly okay. I said I'll do it. You getting a lot of use out of that right now? Force of habit. Don't overthink it. I wonder if they've even noticed we're missing back at headquarters. It'd take a rescue ship so long to get here. Might be another freighter they could divert to try and find us. It's not inconceivable. I suppose you're right. You know, considering this was our last shipment... I don't know. They may not... think about us at all. They're like Don Draper. I don't think about you at all. I'm going. <laughs> okay, of course. I was like, is he still there? Dude, if any of these people are gonna die, it's gonna be Daisuke. He dies first. Okay, open. Come on, stop with the noise. Damn it. I know what everyone is thinking, the way they look at me. What could I even say? And then, what would she do? Damn it! Here we are now, me in the driver's seat. Thanks for that. Open up. I hope these make you feel fucking better. Jimmy, you're like my least favorite character. We have to hear this every time. <laughs> okay, well, I guess he feels slightly better then. We've only got three left. Did you notice? We should have some. Why? It's mediocre at best, obviously. Sometimes you can only get the subpar stuff. That's what makes the really good stuff, well, good, right? Why bother? Hey, we all tried to escape. Didn't work for any of us. Thought many times, is this what, feel, what peace feels like? And is it good enough? If I'm being real, it certainly isn't the best. So all I can do is try and make my life one I'm not trying to run from all the time. Sometimes I'll be promoted, buy a house, fall in love. But other times I'll just have some awful fucking cake with my friend. Right now that sounds pretty brilliant, yeah? So if you'll do the honors... Right. Well, let me go find a knife. Find a knife. Hmm. Interesting. Somebody finally dismantled this horse. 
Ah, oh, here is it. Exploring the ship. I feel like the knife is gonna be down here or something. It can't be in the same room, you would think, since you're allowed to explore. If it was somewhere else, they oh, oh my gosh. Is it in the cockpit? My god. I guess I could pull out the code scanner. It's kind of like a flashlight, but. Well, uh, huh. Feast, it says. Obviously, we're supposed to take the axe, right? Interesting. <laughs> I really like these transitions. They're very well done. Check on the crew. We have an insane amount of mouthwash. Oh. <sighs> How many have you had? Those will kill you before, before anything else. I know. My mom found this internship for me. <laughs> Such a slacker, she said. I don't know. I just never knew what I wanted to be. Never was good at anything. Total screw up. We're not done yet, Daisuke. I just hope she doesn't blame herself. Please, just take it. I don't want to look at this stuff anymore. Don't be daft. Hmm. Oh, maybe somebody was in here. Why I keep checking this, expecting something to be different. Like, I'm interested to see if like the rope's missing or. Anya. Ah! Oh, you startled me. Sorry. No worries. Thinking about drinking that, too? Honestly, yeah. It probably just made me feel sick. I wouldn't fix anything. As much as I'd like it to. Right. Hey, I was thinking, did you know that not all the medicine aboard was in my office? We store some in a storage locker in the hallway. Why haven't you brought this up earlier? It was foamed up. I didn't think it was possible to reach it. But I've been estimating the position of the foam. I think the medicine depot locker isn't too far from the mass of it. So we should try to break it down. One strike too many on a weak spot. We'll all get sucked into space. I think it's worth this, the risk. If nothing else, it's an excuse to get Swansea to hand over the axe. Break the foam. He's dancing with it, huh? Jimbo! El Capitano! The man with the plan. You done? I need that. This old thing? 
And this was entrusted to me by our previous tragically inclined leader. Big responsibility. You know all about that, huh? I'm going to try and get some more painkillers. Do something useful, you know? Oh, ho, ho. I heard all about that. We're looking to pull the plug on this party early. I'm trying to save us. Think matters in your own hands, eh? Be my guest. I think I already feel the ship rumba tumbling through space again. <laughs> Back to the future. All right, thank you. We're talking about like right here. Pure alcohol for medical use only, potentially deadly to ingest. Hmm. Yeah, we need to probably take that. Oh. Hmm. She's gone. Oh, I wonder where she went. Oh, oh, she's right here. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow, Jim. You did it. Yeah, it actually wasn't that hard once I figured it out. Amazing, really? Sure. Um, I hate to ask you again, but... Could you give Carly his painkillers? It still just... Just makes me so nauseous. You're not serious. Look, I've entertained your sentimentality up until now. But I'm trying to actually fix things, Anya. I'm getting us through this. I... I... It's... Find the code scanner. Then figure out the door code. Get the axe. Chop up the foam, but not too much. And best of all, give Curly his fucking medicine. But I'm bearing it. I have to. Because the captain has to take fucking responsibility on this goddamn ship. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to go make sure Daisuke doesn't choke on his own vomit. No, 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 I can. I'll take care of it, Anya. I always do. Yeah, we're out of medicine here. Hmm. Paracetamol. Okay, so that's different than hydrocodone. I don't think I understood the pressure you were under before. Fuck. And you tried to tell me. Our worst moments don't make us monsters, huh? You were a good captain, Curly, and you'll be one again. I'll get a spell through this. Six hours until judgment. Jimmy! Get the fuck out of here! 
Uh, what am I doing? My hands won't stop shaking. Um, six hours until judgment. What am I doing? Tick metal pipe. You can't hide. Um, I'm gonna chop you into 20 fucking pieces. was that two days before the crash you doing okay yeah can't sleep i know how that is i just toss and turn or stare at the ceiling all night i actually kind of like the nighttime window screen if you can believe it so i just come look at it sometimes if you look really really close you can see there's a dead pixel in the upper right corner is that so? Hmm. Nope. Don't see it. In the back of my mind, it's always there. Now I'll go bonkers looking for it. Cheers. I don't think it ruins the illusion, though. It's peaceful. But maybe I'm just used to looking at the bigger picture. How many days of transport do we have left? Uh, let's see, off the top of my head, around 237 days. Just under eight months. Hey, why do you think Pony Express put a lock on the medical room door, but not in the sleeping quarters? Hmm. I suppose for the same reason they put a lock on the cockpit. Safety. Four months after the crash. So this is two months after the last scene. Um, where we were... Jimmy, help! Jimmy, it's total emergency! Calm down. What is it? Anya's stuck in medical. The door won't open. What if she runs out of... Something! Right. Let's go have a look. Anya, I brought Jimmy. We're back to rescue you. Don't worry. Don't panic. Hey, heard the lock's broken. Hey, Anya. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, Jimmy. The rest of our medicine stash is in there, too. Damn, this could be bad. Did you try to really put your back into it? Any wrenches laying around? How heavy is the med kit? Anya, is the door stuck? No. Huh? What do you mean? Look, we're all stressed, but you can't go breaking down at every little hardship. Open the damn door. You were right. You were right all along. I should have done this from the beginning. I always believed that our worst moments didn't define us. Didn't make us beyond repair. You think I wanted this either? Make no mistake. This isn't my worst moment. Far from it. It's the best one I'll ever make. Open the door. I'll take care of it. Anya? What does that mean? Curly is still in there with her, right? Yeah. You don't think... Daisuke, you and Swansea know the internals of the ship better than anyone. There's absolutely no other way into medical? Uh... Um, well... Swansea said it was strictly off-limits. Like, super mega not allowed above all else. The utility room. That busted vent there loops into medical. But, I mean, technically, a person could totally fit through it. 
If that's the only way, we'll make it work. You listening, Anya? Fine. Come on, Daisuke. Not a moment to lose. Don't know how to go downstairs? Gosh, man, man, I don't like this at all. What could I be thinking? We should go check out utility, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of waiting for you to go down the stairs. Wait, is he gonna get teleported? Oh, I think I think he's getting teleported. Rather than show like the animation of him walking down the stairs, maybe? Or... Swansea, we need your help. I know you said utility was dangerous, but I... I'm good right here, fellas. You know, I'm not letting you in there. Off limits. Look. Look, if there's any possibility. Jimbo. Letting you scratch at that foam wall would be useless. You'd only tear this goddamn ship a new asshole. Nothing to be done about it. Bad luck. Tail missed the donkey. But Swansea, this could be really bad. Just hear us out. We're God's hand-picked favorites on this here planet, I reckon. Means we get to name it. So let's hear it for Wake Rock. Whatever's going on anywhere else ain't my problem. Since I'm the happiest man Wake Rock has ever seen. Let's just go, Daisuke. There's no point with him. Don't do anything. Stop, stop, stop. I can fix this. Why do you keep fucking saying that? Are you hearing yourself? Uh, uh, I'm sorry. We still have disinfectant, right? The one from the extra medical stash? Get it, now. The cocktail, we, you. The cocktail? What are you blabbering about? That was your fault. You would never have... I, I had no choice. You... Useless. You goddamn fucking idiot. There has to be something else. Find disinfectant. Hmm. The isopropyl... Oh. Oh. So... Ah. Uh, ha. Huh. Interesting. What are you looking in here? At least try to make yourself useful. God damn it. Okay. Interesting, it's not showing Curly. Judgment. Hmm. They won't let us go to utility. What does it say? Semper deodorant. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it says. It's totally blocked off here. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. I mean, okay. Is there really nothing we can do down here? The gravestone obviously isn't literally there, right? We 
can't go to the cockpit or utility. It won't let us. Okay. Um... The foam is over the cake maker. That sucks. So he's looking in there. I mean, because I there was isopropyl. I don't know if that's. It feels like it should be downstairs, right? So once he's already looking in medical so oh oh I didn't think to do that we're getting Silent Hill 2 again MC Escher shit happening right here. Oh, oh. is that blood? <clears throat> huh. There's blood there that you can't see. A blind beast, aimless and restless, you can't run from it. blood trail, right? Uh, okay, unfortunately, we can't go around there. We're going to... Go around this way. left I think or I might just be here from now on oh my gosh
Jeez. Can't tell where it is. Okay, it's over here. I think this is where we're supposed to go. Wait, where... Where's the blood trail? We should have met up with it. Maybe it's the scratches now? It's like DVD, following the scratch marks. Will lead you to the survivor. I think I'm probably playing it too safe. Here we go. Reunite with the blood. gonna give him the mouthwash mm, I'm, I'm sorry Marie. I messed up don't try to talk <sighs> yes please don't your voice is hard to do <laughs> what is in his mouthwash dragon breath fire fresh does not sound good. Three months after the crash. Okay, so this is, now, we, now we've gone back in time. Because we had four months after the crash when Anya locked herself in the medical bay. No, wait. Now it says three months after the crash. But it said four before. I don't know. I think the vent utility connects to medical. But you heard what he said. Going in there now is too unstable. Trying to break the foam could risk the air seal. I just don't want to fuck up again like I did before. You heard, Anya. I wouldn't put it past her to do something extreme right now. You and me, Daisuke. We could save Curly, yeah? Swansea won't help, so we'll figure it out ourselves. Right. All right, yeah. We got this. But even before the foam, how do we even get the door to utility open? Swansea's been practically camping in front of the door, and he has the key. I have an idea. You're going to have to trust me. We need to knock him out. You're gonna fight him? No. Even he has to have his limits when it comes to booze. We make him pass out. Simple, safe, you might not even realize we did anything after the fact. There's a recipe for a mocktail in the kitchen. We can follow the steps, but use different ingredients to add kick to it. Come on. Well. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I remember seeing the drink here. Yeah. Let's see, mix mouthwash and isopropyl. Oh. So my lights just turned out. I've got lights all around the the room. Oh well, you know what? They've lasted a really long time. I just need to replace them. Okay, mix drink base and sweetener. Okay, so mouthwash and isopropyl with sweetener. How do I get how do I get the sweetener though? We're out of sweetener. Any ideas? Oh, it's not, any, any ideas? I uh, I might have accidentally at some point mistakenly placed misplaced a few packets before, by accident. Right. 
take a look around my stuff. Could be somewhere around there. But also totally somewhere else. Who knows? Anything's possible. The crash sure jumbled everything up. Your stuff. Let's see. <laughs> okay. There's some sweetener right there. Alright, we gotcha. Um, let's see. Mouthwash. It's propyl. Rough mix of mouthwash and ice profile alcohol. Not even Swansea would drink this. But then we put the sweetener together. Mocktail spiked with ice propyl alcohol. Here for a good time. Not a long time. Okay. Are you ready? That drink looks sick. I can totally picture myself on a beach with a hot babe and a few of those. Then I drink too many and throw them up all over myself and never be able to drink them again. Ah, oh, good times. Let's just get this to Swansea. You hate stairs. That's like. Weeping angel over there. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. You taking to teaching my intern now? I personally try to educate based off years of experience, but that's just me, Captain. The fuck is that? Look, we need to keep working together. If this is how I can get us through this without us being at each other's necks all the time, then... Yeah, yeah, give it here. We kind of freestyled the recipe. Yeah, I can tell you how to hand this monstrosity, kid. You ain't no mixologist. Sure as hell ain't no mechanic either. Uh -huh. You never should have come here. Who the fuck even decided to let you board, huh? Stick the idiot with a bunch of sad sack adults and see what he learns, eh? Bootstraps and all that, what a load of horse shit. You think it's all going somewhere, but every failure leaves you a little more mangled than before. Older, uglier, meaner. I don't think I'm drunk for this scene, but it seemed like it at first. Smarter in a worse way. Wallowing doesn't suit you, Swansea. I suppose you think we should all be acting like you. A hard-working, esteemed Capitan. I say, take a load off before the sun finally sets on this party. May we never go to hell, but always be on our way. What is in the utility room? Is he still breathing? He practically bounced off the ground. He'll be fine. His tolerance has to be through the roof by now. Probably just wake up with a massive headache. Oh man, he's gonna be so, so mad. I'll never get a good reference now. Ugh. Owlg. Okay, let's go. Look at the swan on the key. It's a swan key for Swan C. Captain, um, you sure about this? Maybe we could talk with Swansea when he's cleared up a bit later. He's just like really into workplace safety and stuff sometimes, you know? Which is like totally cool and stuff, I think. He taught me. It's time to be brave, Daisuke. Curly and Anya are counting on us. All right. Wait. Whoa. It's like barely foamed up at all. Hey, it's those things. I've never been inside one. What are they called again? Uh, cryostasis pods. Oh yeah. These things are far out. Totally sci-fi. 
Oh, it looks like this one still works. How long can these things even keep you frozen? 20 fucking years. Can't believe Swansea managed to clear all the foam from here. He didn't. What? Think about it. Swansea never let you work with him on breaking the utility room foam wall, right? No. Need to be handled delicately. He said I have way too much athletic strength in my arms. I would have just torn right through the foam. I was like, damn, makes total sense. Bummer. So I've been in charge of the kitchen instead. He said it's next level critical to keep stock and organized every day. I had me double, triple, four tuple, check everything like all the time. Right, of course. And he never told you he'd gotten in here. No, but look how busy he must have been. There was never any foam here. And Swansea has known the whole damn time. Just taking a load off before the sun finally sets on this party, huh? That boozed up bastard has been biding his time until he can save himself. Would getting in the pod really mean you'd get rescued? 20 years more of a chance to get found. I'd take those odds over our current situation. Not like this, though. Not by lying through my teeth while waiting for everyone else to die. No, man, that just can't be right. I, I'm sure there's a reason. We'll ask him about it when he wakes up. <sighs> we'll deal with him after. Right now we have a job to finish. And the vent looks like it's still in one piece. Mm. Oh, check out those sparks. I hate to imagine how gnarly it looks on the inside. It could be somewhat collapsed in places. You could make it through. We need to try it. Um, Swansea said it's not safe. I know he forgot to tell us about the pod, but he knows like everything about this kind of stuff. Maybe we should just wait for him to wake back up. You said you could handle it. Swansea taught you well, right? Time to prove it. He'll be impressed when he wakes up. Proud. He'll understand why we had to do this. Then he can explain himself. You think so? Dice King. Everyone's counting on you. Captain's orders. Yeah, I got this. Okay, here we go. did on you do one day before the crash okay we're curly again find the gun hmm it's still broken she couldn't have hit it there so that's the vent that Daisuke came through huh The gun. So weird seeing everything just totally fine. You're wondering where Anya hid the gun? Already checked here. Um, okay. Do you see the scratches? Huh. Have the scratches been here the whole time? For fuck's sake, where is it? Us being let go isn't a reason to hurt yourself. Anya, as our nurse, you never got psyche vows. I should have thought of that. You 
could have come to me if you were feeling stressed. What would you have done? Anything. Anything. You, the crew, are all my responsibility. I told you so over and over, yeah? I'm not gonna hurt myself. You know the gun is in a safety case I can't open. But I hid the case itself. Tell me where it is. None of this has to be on our performance log. We'll figure it out together. I'm pregnant. You... You what? Who would you... Captain, I told you. Listen to me. We can fix this. I've known him for a long time. I'll talk to him. I know you'd never give me the gun to protect myself. So the least I can do is make sure he never gets it either. Detected abnormal asteroid trajectories along the route. Course corrections might be required during transit. Hmm, foreshadowing. Huh. Six hours until judgment. The bleeding won't stop. Just try to stay still, Daisuke. I, I need a second to think. We can fix this. Hey, kid, you hear me? Uh, Daisuke? <laughs> hey, stop, stop, stop. Don't move. It's all right, Daisuke. Calm down. This line of work. You could never become like miserable old Swansea. What a tragedy. Decades of hauling ass for Pony Express. Big, mighty bruiser with all his shiny tools. This is where it got me. <laughs> the good life, huh? I thought you were dumber than a can of paint. Always just chewing my ear off about nothing. Useless ray of goddamn sunshine. Not an A student, career workhorse, or force of ambition. Just a damn good kid trying his best. You could have taught an old fool like me a lot. Close your eyes, Daisuke. Hmm. You, you monster. I could have fixed him, Swansea. I could... I have to do everything myself. Why can't any of you just give me some time to fucking think? How do you still not understand? It's over. End of the fucking line. He won't suffer one more second because of your delusions. Unbelievable. Stop pretending. I know all about your plan, Swansea. I went to utility. I saw what you've been hiding down there. Sneaking around with that axe. Telling Anya who knows what. Now this? You're making sure you're the one who gets inside that cryopod. Ha! <laughs> I sure did talk to Anya, but it was her telling me all sorts of things instead, wasn't it? Shouldn't the captain go down with his ship? Not that it matters anymore. I ain't got no place to be. I got everything I could ever want right here on this ship. So go ahead and get in that pod. If you ever get found, you can tell them whatever fucking story you like. You've earned it. The game has gotten extremely depressing. Okay, you'd think it's not medical, right? Well. Oh my god, he's still alive. Oh my god. 
Gotta use the code scanner. Where's the code? Can't look at his blood anymore. Who's... Okay, what happened, though? What happened? Okay, we need the three-digit code. Would it be in... Captain's quarters? Curly's quarters? No. The code for the case. Well, I think the code for the case is in utility. I mean, could it be in the cockpit somewhere? Captain's quarters, so to speak. Looking around, might be in here. This would be a good place for it. Seven three nine, okay. Seven three nine, that's gotta be it. Put it away now. Um, okay. So I'm getting the gun. Where is Swansea right now? Something funny? The bloody handprint right there. Jimmy! Oh. What does Curly think is so funny? I told him. Anya, you... You should have waited for me. What do you say? Nothing that makes any difference. Did you seem angry? Where did he go? He just walked away. Curly, I don't want him in here anymore. Hold on, fuck, fuck. I just wait. I need to find him. Everything's gonna be okay. I mean, you would assume. You would assume it's Jimmy. Why do I feel like there's some sort of... Why do I feel like I'm about to be fight clubbed right now? Jim, I can fix this. What do you think will happen when we get back? Hmm? We can figure all this out. You and me. All I ever hear is how great of a leader you are. God, it's so annoying. But now, what do you think will happen now when we get back? We'll fix this together. Everything you and I worked for in our lives, accomplishments, changes, none of it will matter. You've gotten through difficult situations before. This time won't be any different. 
Work through it, one day at a time. It's not just me, is it? You were supposed to be the one who had everything under control. You said so yourself. The ship, this crew, everything that happened here. This was your responsibility, Captain. That is what you'll be hearing the rest of your life. Or, this can all be remembered as a tragedy, despite what must have been the best efforts of its acclaimed captain. The Tulpar crew was never found. No one survived to tell the tale. You're standing at the top, feet in cement. I get it now, right? Right. I'll take care of it. Jim, tell me you didn't. I should have. I didn't. What the fuck did you do? Curly's not the one who that we were playing at the very beginning. We were playing as Jimmy. Happy birthday, Captain. This rocks. Here, here. To Captain Jimbo. Come on. You have to give a speech. Go on, have at it. You better make it good. Hell yeah. Our Captain, Captain Jimmy. Oh my god. Oh no. A lot of people struggle to put food on their plates, but that wasn't enough, right, Captain? The lowest rung of your ladder is our highest, until it was all swept from under your feet. Life isn't even worth living at the same level as us. But I forgive you, all of us do. I won't give up on you, even like this. I believe in you. We're going to make it through this. Sometimes we thrive, travel the endless reaches of space. But other times we just have to accept days like these. You taught me that, Curly. Let's eat. Let's survive. What does it say? Where the fuck are my keys? Okay. It 
It's a big ladder. Or that these are big vents. Huh. I mean, I guess this is just... Yeah, there's like board game pieces. Oh, I don't have the code scanner. weird. I'm like walking backwards. Okay. Um, yeah, we can't turn around. It's dice case stuff. We're getting bluebird right now, but this is an example of good bluebering. towards the light. That flower again that we saw in that grave. For Semper Deodor. Our friend. Our dearly beloved. <laughs> dearly departed, rather. Issue to captains in case of unrest among the crew. I don't think I have a choice. I think this is a really linear game. Is this the My Bones graveyard? I love it all smooth. Sorry, probably most of you don't get that. That's okay. Beloved friend, I remember you, so you are eternal. I don't think we need to explore the whole... Oh! 
Oh, that was actually him? Oh my god. That's really good. <laughs> oh, what? Thought if you aimed the gun at him, then he... He left. Did you do it quickly enough? Can't go through here. Huh. Am I trying to get anywhere or am I just trying to kill him? Like, shoot him a certain number of times. Is that back where I started? I had to find all three of them. I had to find Daisuke's. I had to find Anya's. Oh, just three. We had to shoot him three times. Okay. I understand. I have something to say. So shut the fuck up and listen. Mm, I spent 13 years half cut up to my eyeballs. Drunk to put it mildly. Then suddenly I saw it, a street light shining in my face. 500 gigawatts of the power of God, a vision of my bloated body bound in some ditch. Scared me straight. So I got a collar shirt, mortgage, and a credit card. All the things that make a good man. I hoped I could raise my children to be better than their old man. I wanted to believe I was never one setback away from my worst self. But the truth is, discipline, drive, routine, the endless fucking desperation to get shit done. A loving wife, great kids, sobriety, I'm telling you, you. Accomplishments I'd been chasing my all my life, never felt as good as I expected when I crossed the finish line. So now that we're at the end, take an inventory. Those nights spinning out of my head, sinking into the sofa, broken glass in my palms, bleeding dry, the funniest thing ever. Old dogs laughing and snarling on a waterbed floor, mocking the moon for daring to show its face. All nausea and wreckage and vomit and ugly cruelty. The only problem in the world an empty bottle. Those were the best days of my life. Yeah. Those were the best days of my life. I got nothing to hide. Ready to face the music. 
I can see myself for what I am. But you? A cowardly, selfish motherfucker, and you can't even see it. I should have been able to protect the kid. If I could have done one thing right, I wish it had been to give him one small chance off this goddamn rock. Swansea, I'm going to fix everything. We're, we're going to make it. Fuck you. But we're not going to take responsibility, are we? We've thought about it, and we've decided that we will not. We won't do it. So it's just me and Curly now. Where are we? No, they're bluebering me. I'm getting bluebird. Oh. I hadn't noticed. Curly's the only one that knows what Jimmy did. And he feels the guilty eye staring at him. Or in this case, eyes. Go back. Oh, that's what we came out of. Tis old Mother Goose's birthday. We're giving her a party. A party, a party, a party for Mother Goose. The baker man, he served the cake. It was a sight to see. Oh my god, are we eating Curly? <laughs> okay. Sorry, my, uh... Oh, okay. know what we're doing sorry I thought it was I thought it was just gonna keep going someday he'll thank me okay not really sure what all this is Are we trying to get... Are we trying to get it to 
make some kind of shape. But I don't know what kind of shape we're trying to get it to make. I don't know what it is we're doing. Oh my god, are we making him eat his leg? Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? I see. Okay, wait, I gotta pay attention. I gotta pay attention. Okay. There we go. You gotta make them point the right way. Okay. Okay. Wow. Awesome. Oh. I'm I'm walking as the guy right now. That's Jimmy. I want to go home. We are home. Why don't you finish what you started? Don't worry. If anyone ever finds us, I'll still be playing the villain. You'll be the better man in the end, like you wanted. I could have stopped it. I, I'm taking responsibility. No. We, we can both be heroes. We're a team. Just you and me, like we used to be. What happened was an accident. We were trapped. I made a mistake, all right? I'm sorry. I'm so fucking sorry, Curly. I do wish Jimmy would take responsibility already. What is this? <laughs> what are we looking at? Huh? What? What? You do it? What am I doing with this? Ultrasound scanner. Take care of it. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. 
This is very interesting. Kind of disturbing. Not loving it. All clean. I hope this hurts. Really gets rid of that bad taste in your mouth, huh? Through wreckage. Through silence. Wash it away. All day fire fresh. Scratches over here. Huh. Nothing, nothing in my inventory. Um. Okay, wait. What the hell do I do? Oh, oh, this way. For some reason, I just didn't see it. Oh my god. Yeah, it's some like. Bastardization of Polly. Oh my god. Polly the the horse. It turned into like a weird centipede thing. I Oh my god. I don't know what to do. Am I supposed to like find stuff? Yeah, because I don't know. I don't really know what to do. Wait, my. No, 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 I moved, I moved, I moved. I'm supposed to follow the scratches. I figured out the last second. But I think I was kind of supposed to get hit. Oh, these are the IDs. Pony Express is dead, and so are you. Polly says, Shut up. Curly tried his best. I did too, but he's the better man. I see that now. We can both still make it. I'll take care of him. I'm taking responsibility. Curly. Captain. I'm so sorry. Yes. 
Yes, 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 I do. I fucked up. But I can still make this right. Our worst moments don't make us... I mean, the way it has to end is Curly goes in the cryopod, right? Okay, this isn't... Oh, okay, but it goes to utility, because that's where we want to go. That's where we need to go. I'd love to go home. Wait, am I supposed to turn around or? No, 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 there's a door at the end of the hallway. Yeah, he's going in the cryopod. And we're not. It's okay, Curly. You're gonna be okay. You always had my back. I ended up hurting you even though I was trying to save us. But now you'll survive. It's like you said, together we can fix anything. I'm just proud I got to be your friend and co-pilot, Captain. No one can hurt you now. We fixed it. I fixed it. Yep. That's what I thought. Well, damn. <laughs> um, yeah, that was a crazy game. That was really good. Um, okay, so yeah, mouthwashing. I mean, it's like, it's like a Black Mirror episode turned video game. I mean that as a compliment. Uh, yeah, it's like, you know how a lot of games take inspiration from Silent Hill 2? But then they just kind of end up doing Silent Hill 2 again. I feel like this is a great example of like a psychological horror game that works. So many psychological horror games, they, they're too derivative of Silent Hill 2 to where they like copy it, its homework almost exactly. They're too derivative of PT in particular, Ugh, where it's like almost an identical experience, but worse. And I feel like this is like probably the first time, it's the first time I can think of where like I played a indie psychological horror game that I've been like, well, this was unique and good and creepy and thought provoking and everything that psychological horror should be. Yeah. You know what? I gotta say too, I like that the game starts off being very grounded. You know, you're talking with real people in a real situation and like, yeah, it's a little quirky and zany, you know, like a warehouse full of mouthwash, you know, right? But for the most part, it's pretty grounded. And then 
after the first hour and a half to two hours or so, the game starts progressively getting more and more psychedelic, more and more hallucinatory, more and more like detached from reality. And then it brings it back at the end when Jimmy puts Curly in the pod and is like, okay, we're back to reality now, you know? And there's so much stuff that happened that you're like, was that literal? Was that metaphorical? I, th I choose to believe a lot of it is metaphorical. You know, a lot of it is Jimmy wrestling with his guilt for being a terrible person, um, for being the one to make the ship go on a collision course because he wanted to take everyone else down with him. But then, you know, not only did it not really work, uh, Curly ended up being, you know, deformed from it. And then Jimmy blamed Curly afterwards and was like, he's the one who did it. It's all his fault. And so then they had months of his crewmates, you know, resenting the captain over it. But Jimmy finally took responsibility at the very end for his awful decision. Because he was jealous of Curly and he wanted... Uh, he wanted to be the big decision maker, the big captain man. I think it's a pretty compelling story. Um, yeah, I enjoyed it. It's definitely like a surprise horror game of the year contender for me. I think, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna have to think about that in terms of like where it stacks up at the end of the year. Cause I think it's definitely like top five that I've played so far for me. Um, I had a good time with it. It's good of a time as you can have with as thoroughly unpleasant an experience it was. Again, meant as a compliment. But yeah, I think if there was like, there's a couple things I could nitpick. Like when you get out of dialogue with someone, you have to right click to get out of it before you can move around again. And so there were like a few times when I'd be like trying to move around and I'd be like, I'm stuck. Uh, just little things like that here and there that I could nitpick, but overall, I'd say it was a great experience from beginning to end. So, yeah, mouthwashing. Let me know what you thought in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Think critically.